Let's do Hitman. The Undying. Why not hit woman? That's racist. You better watch your mouth. I'm trans, does that mean if you hit me, you hit a woman? Oh man, we're getting political. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Switch to VR mode now. I didn't know this game had a VR mode. Play for- do I want to hit this? Is this it? If I'm trying to do the, uh, kill Sean Bean shit? Or did I not buy the Sean Bean thing? Did I not buy the right thing? Hang on. Hitman the Undying Pack. Oh. Son of a bee sting. Hang on. Oh no, now I got to sign into PayPal. Give me a sec. I spent like $150 on games for Shisho Saturday. Um, and it didn't have any issues. But as soon as I try to spend $4.99 on a DLC, I have to make sure I verify. How does that work? Okay. Do I need to restart my game? Probably. Let's Alt F4. Click the live tab at the top in game. Hang on. Roblox next. It's on the list. Ugh. How is VR even detected? It's not even plugged in. What? Okay, live at the top. 29 days of this, huh? Okay, The Undying Returns 2024. I assume this, this is one it. This might ring a bell, 47. Your target is Mark Faber also known as the Undying. A disgraced former MI5 operative currently working as a freelance assassin, Faber has been confirmed killed by ICA agents more than a dozen times. On every occasion, he has managed to come back from the dead. We have confirmation that Faber has a meeting in the Miami Bayside Center to review details on a new target. An informant at the site has provided us with reliable intel on Faber's expected movement around the center. 
This information has revealed several viable approaches. As you know, our inside man is meeting with a target. Acquire the right disguise, and he'll get you inside the heart of the building. Up close and personal is risky, but favors the clean kill. Alternatively, smuggle in a sniper rifle via briefcase. The race tower is a perfect vantage point, but access is restricted. Race security is high. Get through the locked door and time your shot perfectly. Or infiltrate through the staff entrance at the back of the building. Access the second floor using the elevator shaft. Move unseen inside the weapons demo room and infiltrate as you see fit. Act once an opportunity presents itself. Or rig the room to your advantage and leave unseen. I mean, In can I just make my own decisions? The repercussions of being exposed here would be severe. I'm confident even more opportunities will reveal themselves once you arrive on site. 47. I feel I'm repeating myself a little bit here, but please make sure he doesn't come back again. Good luck. Okay. What? Wait, I only get one try? I don't even know how to play. I forgot all the key bindings. All right, let's do it. Fuck it. Let's just go. I got a lot of other games to play. Elusive target confirm. I've seen like a YouTube video. I think it was Atriok. Good afternoon, 47. He has like Your speedrunners play this shit. He sets up crazy stuff. Faber has a full day of meetings planned. I don't know if you guys have seen those videos. They're crazy. Take your time with this one. Oh, my sensitivity Game is off too. Our informant is waiting for you in the reception area. If you like, he can lead you to a meeting where Faber will be in attendance. What you do from then on is up to you. Be mindful though. You will not wait around for long. Okay. Uh Hello. You must be Dave Reddy. How you? Ah, yes. You're the one I've been expecting. That's me. A special guest. I am. Okay. So, like I told your superiors, I can get you inside the meeting, but that's it. What you do from there is up to you. Got it? Just how I like it. All right. Uh, but uh, you can't go in dressed like that. You'll need to look like an engineer or one of the lab guys or or a guard, I guess. I'll work something out. Good. I'll wait for you here. The ICA has struck a deal with Dave Reddy, one of the two men your target has come to Miami to meet with. Reddy got in some trouble with the Moreno cartel, and the ICA has promised to clear it up for him if he helps us get close to Mark Faber. Reddy is currently waiting for you in the reception area of the Bayside Center. Okay. Don't take too long. They're expecting us upstairs in the conference room. All right, here's a guy with an outfit I could use. Uh, X to vault. All right, I'm not gonna snap his neck. Grab his outfit. Uh, some sort of card. Drag. Uh, is there a body dump anywhere? Hang on. Surely you can go so oh Get the fuck in there How's this where'd you find that da, 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 never mind I don't want to know let's go Fabe is already expecting us up there can't wait to meet him excellent 
He didn't kill him. Won't he just come out of the closet or will that just make him gay? Hmm. <laughs> Deep questions. So, this deal is closed when we enter the room, all right? I get you in, that's all. And then your people take care of my problem. Don't worry. We'll fulfill our end of the bargain. Solid. Uh, uh, you know, I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. Getting involved with people like the Morenos, it, it was stupid. I thought I could make some quick cash, you know? Buy that yacht, sail a couple of babes to the Caribbean for the summer. Stupid. The Marino cartel is the biggest in the Southern Hemisphere. You don't try to cheat those kind of people. I wish I'd met you a little earlier, buddy. Could have used that advice six months ago, you know? Anyway, we're almost there, so, uh... Let me look at the map here. Wow. I don't even know where my target is. I'm that is Mark Faber. Oh, there he is. The most elusive man in the history of the ICA. I'm Mark Faber. Mr. Faber! What an absolute pleasure to meet you. <laughs> I'm Dave Reddy, special acquisition gatekeeper working with you on this job. <laughs> I'd show you my break book, but I'm sure you've already heard about me. How do I look at my inventory? Oh, jeez. Oh, uh, I see. Before we begin, I just wanted to tell you that I've read up on your file. Oh, man. Very impressive. It's all about enjoying what you do. Couldn't agree more, my friend. I've prepped an extensive briefing to help us sync up on the subject that needs to be uh, <laughs> consulted with. I think it'll provide you with a full 360. Good. Let's proceed. Hey, not a problem, Mark. Not a problem at all. All right. Well, okay, he likes drinking that. This show on the road. Okay, so the consultation is with a man called Pavel Sukov. A relative of your boss's former partner. 10-4. For the last six months, Zukov has been dishing out malicious rumors about my good friend Bob Knox. Did some digging, and it turns out he's publishing a book about the secret beginning of Kronstadt Industries. <laughs> Completely ridiculous effort. But the rumors are putting a hard stop on the growth of our stock. He's been putting out some very quotable things in the media lately. So, Knox is looking to protect the bottom line. This Sukov fella, he's enjoying the limelight. There was a press conference a week ago, yeah? Huh. You've really done your homework. You're right. He's showering in media attention. <laughs> Is that going to be a problem? On the contrary. I prefer public consultations. Nowhere better to hide than in the middle of a spectacle. Well, then this is your bluebird, my friend. You know what? Let's try a small exercise. Uh oh. You. Suppose you were sent to kill me. We're in this meeting together. You're sitting there in the chair, waiting for your moment. Uh. How would you kill me? What's the plan? Cause a small distraction. Lure you out onto the balcony and throw you over the railing to your death below. You look strong enough, but there are bushes down there. They break the fall. I'd walk away without a single broken bone. What else? You've been drinking quite a lot of coffee. Yes. Fast-acting poison. Emetic. About five seconds from ingestion to reaction. Follow you to the bathroom. Drown you. Terrible accident. Gruesome. But I survived worse than that. Final bid? Knife on the table over there. Quick throw. Knife through the head. You'd be dead before you hit the floor. <laughs> That's more like it. But very risky. You'd have a hard time escaping the room. But I would love to see you try that. Okay. I think I'll just head over to that new fella and have a look at the equipment. I'll come back. Interesting. I didn't think he'd, like, confront me like that out of nowhere. Hi, it's me. Hey, I got a space bubble, and you're in it. Okay, sorry. Well. How should I kill? Okay, let me see where he goes. I gotta study this guy now. I assume I'm not allowed to go this way. Oh. Well, maybe there's some goodies in here. 
peep. Okay, there's scientists in this room. I assume I'm not allowed back here. The android showroom. Oh, whoa, 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 okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, the control button gives me widow vision. Hmm. Android arm, pick up. Uh. Was there a way to, a place to hide a body here? Okay, there's no one in this hallway. Oh, hello. Hmm. I feel like I need to get one of these guys' outfits. Okay. Sir, you're not allowed to pass. Sorry. Well done, pal. The fuck? I have to say, I'm feeling a bit of pride swell up inside me. Maybe that's just the burrito I had earlier. Maybe I can cause some accident in there? Hmm. I suck at this game. Ooh. Outside. Employees only. Who's in here? There's a closet. Okay, I can store two bodies in here. So I can kill both scientists. And maybe drag them out this way. It seems pretty safe. All right. So I just run over, beat the fuck out of him, and then throw the arm at his head. Double knockout. And then both bodies in the closet, and I take their outfits. Let me make sure my path is clear. Double checking. Wait, when did the camera get in here? Oh no, it's just going through the wall. That's fucked up. Oh shit. Okay, hold oh, on. Watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. How do I fight? Owned. Come on, keep them coming. Oh, okay, so I, this is as fast as I can go. Uh, hang on, hang on. Better kill the one that saw your face. No, it's okay, because I changed my outfit. Now I'm not a witness, or they're not, they don't know who I am. They can wake up. What? Should I kill them then? Dump. Losers. Putting them in the locker where they belong. Like the dweebs they are. Alright, now I'm the android man. Uh, what do I want to do in here? Scan picture android targeting system. Why is his arm all fucked up? Oh, I need an ID card of some sort. Did they not drop an ID card? Oh. Item obtained. Scan. Interesting. A 
Okay, so his arm's all fucked up, but it works. How could I kill Sean Bean with this? Maybe I need to like spray paint a letter on his chest. Hello, I'm just a scientist. Don't mind me. I wonder if this is how Oppenheimer felt in those final days before he got all sappy and melodramatic. Palace, my boy, the potential that resides inside you is astounding. Do it. You are by far my finest creation. If I do it, though, it's going to mess up. Virtually impervious to small arms fire, the powers be able to be upgraded and eventually replacing the standard. Mission failed. I don't know who that guy even is. Why would I kill him? There's also an elevator at the back. Training facility controlled by remote. Why not? Uh, because then the other guys are like, oh my god, scientists killed like no. You're crazy. Y'all are dumb. With a wide range of targeting capabilities from infrared vision to DNA sampling. Hmm. Extremely advanced facial recognition systems capable of complex skin texture analysis. Okay, this guy is just rambling as he walks by himself. Like, who's he talking to? <laughs> I guess I could try and kill him. I don't know. I need him to come back. Because I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be allowed back here, right? Sir, please move on. Oh, sorry. It's just a scientist. I'm not allowed there. Well, maybe I can go this way. Okay, there's a body dump right here. Wait, this scientist is allowed in here. Why am I not? Oh, I'm good. Uh, octane booster. Blend in. What's an octane booster do? Also, if I loot this, are people mad? Oh, sorry. That's enough. Sorry, how do I put it down? Invent I. Drop. Oh fuck. <laughs> I thought What did I just do? That's it? <laughs> Dropped it on the ground and it blew up. I, I didn't even, I thought it was like poison or something. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it said explosive. Yeah, but I didn't think it was like, you know, breaking bad shit where it's like, oh, set it down. Damn. And that's it. Okay, next game. Fucking suck.